I didn't see there was just busy being awesome. My name is Chad Osborne and I'm the leader of the High School Ministries and I just want to paint a picture for you of what we do here at Student Ministries. On the first and third Sunday of the month we have Reunion! <laughs> hey, about to say Reunion! I'm so excited. From 6 to 8.30, we get together, eat a meal. We dance to rock videos from the 80s. Don't stop believing. Whoa. We do a student interview where we really dig deep into the hearts of the students. With questions like, who would win in a fight between Mike Ditka and whoever? Who, America? You tell me. Because let's face it. Ditka always wins. Ditka always wins. Always. We also worship. Worship. We also have a solid content time where we talk about Jesus and stuff. Look, I have a beard. We do this because we think it's important for teens to have fellowship with other believers their own age. On the second and fourth Sunday of every month, we do home groups. I say home groups, baby. Can you feel me? Home groups is basically the same concept as house church, but for teens. We go to different homes in the area to have a meal, go through some great curriculum and break into small groups for prayer and accountability. For more information on home groups, check out the cafe table in the lobby. We also have local and global missions opportunities, including Target Dayton in Dayton and back-to-back -back ministries in Monterey, Mexico. So keep your eyes and ears open for that. Man, I have a lot of hair. As you can see, we gather, grow, and we go. 3G model, baby! But of course, I don't oversee student ministry alone. Greg Baker is the director of middle school. And the female director is Miss Melanie Line. We do make a good team. So why do we do what we do? It certainly isn't the paycheck. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. We believe this generation is going to make an impact. Impact! Boom! Impact, baby! On the world around them. And we want to equip them to do that in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. To know and obey the King of Kings. To know and obey the King of Kings. Stay sweet.